Hey guys, it's Thad and Inkid, and headphones are a pair of devices which are supposed to provide us with great quality of sound and comfort, since you pay good money for them. But has there ever been moments where you bought a new pair of headphones and somewhere deep inside your heart, you felt, hmm, they aren't as good as I thought they would be, but you still try to use them even while they're just unbearable. So if you are not one of these guys, I guess you have some great shopping luck to begin with. But if you are, then you clicked on the right video. These are the top 4 things to remember before you buy your favorite pair of headphones. Keep in mind, some of this you must have heard already, but most of this you do forget to remember in your day to day basis and in your nearest electronics store. So let's jump right in. Number 1. The Release Date Now for the audio files out there, yes they do need to check the specifications first. But for us casual listeners who don't know chickens about specs, Always check the release date. To clear out stocks, shopkeepers keep old headphones in the front and new headphones at the back, which tricks the consumer into buying old outdated technology. And trust me, in years, sound and comfort take huge leaps forward. Sometimes the product is even discontinued for good, and discontinued stuff is never trustworthy. Number 2. Look out for knockoff brand names. These days, even Flipkart is selling fake Beats by Dre's. But hey, at least they're Beats by Dre. Of course, this doesn't apply to people who really want to flaunt around with their brand new knockoff Beats by Dre. I'm not judging anyone since money is an issue everywhere, but if, I, if you consider sound, do look out for these. Number 3. Trial Boots In India, you don't know what you're buying until you've already bought it, and you can't even return it once you've paid for it, at least in the stores. So I suggest always look out for trial boots or tell the shopkeeper to first let you try out your headphones before you buy them. You will be sure what you're about to buy this way, since returning stuff here is next to impossible. Finally, number 4. Reviews. If you really like that something in the store you saw, with all sorts of designs on it and colors and flashy stickers etc etc, don't pay for it right away. Don't be the impulsive shopper. Take out your phone, turn on your mobile data and watch or read a review or two. You would know what you're buying. And having this said, this sums up our guide. If you try to acknowledge even one of these while shopping, for any electronics you won't possibly go wrong. Apparently I bought the Skullcandy GI from my local electronics store. Reliance to be precise and I didn't follow anything mentioned above. So they turned out to be really famous in 2009. Problem being 2009. Now the tech is outdated and discontinued and you can't find them anywhere else because they're discontinued. <laughs> Not to forget the comfort also sucks so it's an all around package of suckiness. Anyways, so I made this video dedicated to that and my inspiration was Reliance. So thumbs up for that and thanks Reliance for being my inspiration for today's video. Also like if you liked the video and dislike it if you disliked it. Thanks for watching and have a wonderful day. This is the At Indian Kid signing out and subscribe. Also shout out to my uncle for gifting me a wonderful tripod and shout out to my dog for participating in my video. If he wouldn't have slept in my work area, I wouldn't have shot that video. Shot. So I guess, yeah, both shoutouts go to them. Yeah, I hope you enjoyed that video. Once again, thanks for watching. This is the first time I showed my face. It, it's, kind of, it's kind of a tech vlog. Yeah. Okay, I'm signing up.